G'day, g'day! How the honk are ya? Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dan O, and we are continuing on with the Land Rover 90 from Matchbox, the casting MB180. Right now, you are looking at the website from BAMCA.org. This, ladies and gentlemen, is number 47. We are up to number 47. We are uh, moving right along. This is the um, second series, uh, the first series, and we'll be tagging them at the end and throughout the video. Um, the last one, we'll, we'll tag that right now, right up here. Uh, the last one with the uh, uh, first, what was it, five, six cars? And um, so that leaves us up to number 47, which is this one right here. This is a navy blue with a white top. This is the Stars of Germany black base with Thailand on it, 2005. Yes, 2005. Do not have it. Unbelievable. So moving on to the next one, number variation number 48. Another one I don't have. I don't think I have it. I looked around. Uh, it looks familiar. It's from a playset. It's not a uh, uh, single card. It's from a playset. I thought I had one. I don't have one loose, obviously, but I thought I had it in the playset, but I can't find it if I do have it. Uh, and so I need more. But anyway, this one is a matte olive with a brown top, uh, number 80, mud splattered on it, brown base with Thailand on the base, come from a 10-pack. That's where it came from, a 10-pack. So there's another one that I am on the hunt for, number 48. Unbelievable. <laughs> Uh, apparently they're hard to come by. This was in uh, 2006, so I've seen them, uh, but they must call for a pretty penny, and uh, they're they're distributed uh, uh, worldwide. It's not like it's uh, um, German only or, or uh, European uh, only, but uh, yeah, I checked my uh, ten packs there, and uh, I have nothing. All right, let's move on. Uh, number 49, we're going to go over to the desktop now, the table there. I've got this one. All righty, back on the uh, tabletop here, and we're going to go with number 49, and it is this beauty right here. It is uh, green with a white top, black base, Thailand stamped on the base, uh, obviously with the... Uh, uh, chainsaw or saw blade saw blade wheels uh, number 55 got the Great Britain on there on the side no details on the back or the front just uh, mirrored images on the side very nice car uh, once again this one uh, I got these these have got the dot the dots on them these are all loose this is the three that I've got and I told you that story. I got that from uh, Iola Car Show. Uh, the guy selling them, he bought a guy's collection. And his collection was nothing but five packs. So here's the five pack that it came from. It doesn't really have a name, I guess. Just a five pack. Uh, a couple of different cars. Got the hum Hummer in there, the Jeep. Uh, the van, news van thing. And then uh, the uh, Land Rover on top the 90 on top so there you go five pack only so that was 2006 2007 number 50 now uh pay attention here this is uh interesting one also only came in a five pack did not um have a name to it they didn't they didn't uh make names or anything they just uh I am ready for action, and uh, Volkswagen has got the Land Rover 90, Jaguar, and another Volkswagen, and then the cab there, but uh, only came in the five pack. Now these, I've got two of them, loose, and I'm uh, going to take a look at them, kind of, they're kind of beat up. This is the nicer one of the two, 
Uh, nice, nice, uh, soft baby blue. Uh, gray interior with the gray uh, bull bar there, the gray interior. Uh, clear windows. But it, it, the nice is that it has uh, rear details. They even painted the rear bumper on there, uh, 180, which, funny enough, that's the uh, the model number is MB, Matchbox 180. And then uh, Great Britain sticker there. Nice detailing. Um, and then they did some headlights and, uh, you know, turn signals up front. You can't hardly see them. They're, they're gray and orange there, but, uh, yeah, really kind of nice. Now I want you to take close attention to these wheels because we're going to be talking about these wheels later on. Now, this is the first time that we haven't seen <laughs> The goofy saw blade wheels. Yeah, they finally got away from the uh, saw blade, and this is the first time. Now, this is a classic wheel that we all know and love now uh, in the Matchbox world, but uh, very, very nice truck. All right, number 51 was uh, 19, uh, 2007. What am I saying, 19? 2007, and uh, it's uh, super fast. Super fast. Uh, there were only 15,500 of these, limited edition of 15,500. And uh, and uh, black with uh, gray. We'll just take a look at the packaging right now. Actually, I want to show you this. I <laughs> made a little note because I have something kind of going on with this one here. It's kind of hard to tell, but if you look at the wheel and the wheel arch there, uh, you can tell that this one's kind of got a little gap, and this one is like low rider. Yeah, if uh, we can get them both in the frame. This one here, something's going on. I don't know exactly what's going on with it, but it is set low. You can see more on the front that, uh, you know, there there is something going on. So, yeah, way <laughs> this one almost is wonky the other way. But... Uh, yeah, so interesting there. It was number 18. Now, this one, uh, they called it the Land Rover Defender 90. And uh, they used, uh, instead of Land Rover 90 and spelling it out in the word. So, uh, very, very kind of interesting there. But uh, that was it. Uh, super fast. And I've got two on the card. And I've got two loose. Matter of fact, one of these I just picked up not too long ago. This one's kind of got rusty axles on it. And the bull bar is a little bit uh, wonky there. But this here, nice one. I think I pulled this one out of the package myself. I think I had three of these. Black with silver and gray. Nice checker plating on there. Very nice model. Uh, TDI on the... Uh, front quarter panel right behind the mud flap there and a defender on that uh, slant there that is very nice black with a gray interior light gray with a black bull bar now usually that bull bar is the color of the interior but they must have painted that got has a white top and gloss black base uh, Thailand but uh, once again a um, little bit different tire this is not the uh, the normal one per se. This is kind of like the uh, five circle in a circle. Uh, so it's a little bit different. Not quite like the uh, the the new style uh, one ten that came out. Not quite like that. But uh, very nice. So two thousand seven for number fifty one. And we're gonna go to number fifty two in two thousand seven was this one here if we can focus boy we like the background today we like the background all right so this one came in 2007 uh black back with the saw blade but this time it's uh, a gray and um uh, nice gloss black it's got the uh dragons and a and a uh, uh sword and I'm not really sure, what does that say over there? Does that say something? I don't know, CXXC. Not really sure what that means. But then on the red 
roof. That's a plastic roof. It's got the crest of a bird. Yeah, <laughs> of a bird. I don't know what that is. But uh, no front details, no back details. Now, these are kind of hard to come by, kind of, because I, I just have... Oh, yeah, and uh, it has a brown base to it, which is kind of odd. But a uh, brown base with uh, Thailand. So very, very, very kind of cool. Uh, so, so the bumper is brown and uh, very kind of cool. Well, anyway, I got three loose ones, but these are kind of hard to come by because they came in this, the uh, hitch and haul. Now I've got two of these on the card still. Uh, I almost forgot about them. I, I don't have these on display yet. I'm still uh, putting stuff away. So I've got uh, two of them on the card. And uh, so let's take a look at this. This is uh, hitch and haul. I guess you're supposed to hitch and haul your catapult. Yeah. And it got some knights there and a uh, dragon, red dragon there. Yeah. So dragon castle is what it's called. Working rigs, matchbox. So 2007, this came out. Very cool. Very cool. Just take a look at the back there. Working catapult. There you go. Yeah. Collect them all. So there it is. So that's the uh, 2007 number variation number 52. All right. We're going to uh, jump into uh, number 54. 53. Excuse me. <laughs> 53. And that is this bugger right here. Um, I believe, yes, this came in a five pack as well. And, uh, hence the dot. Yeah. I got a couple of them with the dots on them still. So I can't got those from, uh, the guy, you know, the story. And, uh, I've got, uh, four of them that are kind of beat up and I got two of them that are in pristine condition. And this is where things get exciting. Same beautiful blue paint job. Details on the back, beautiful. Details on the front, beautiful. But if you take a look, there is a difference with your wheels. All right, let's jump back and take a look at number 50. Yeah, low profile. Beep, beep, beep. And the regular, uh, regular profile. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah, there you go. So I do not have any of these in the five pack. Came out in 2007, uh, which ironically, this is 2007 as well. So I'm not sure if this is, uh, I don't know. Must be a later time in the, in the year, but uh, pretty much the same, the same thing. Uh, they've got the same base on them. Stuff like that, just just a different wheelbase. So uh, yeah, that's that's it right there. So we're gonna end with number uh, 53 on 2007 with this beautiful model. It's a beautiful model, a nice baby blue. If you got one of these, let me know. A white top, clear with a gray interior, gray. Uh, just a nice truck. All right, I think I got one more video with uh, these, um, I've been calling them the new wheels, the uh, saw blade wheels, even though now we're getting away from the saw blades, we're getting just regular wheels. Uh, so I got one more video, I think another five or so to finish up this casting, MB180, and uh, then we'll move on to uh, the next casting of the Land Rover Defender 90 in the Matchbox range. All right, that's it for today. Thank you for joining with joining me today. Come on over to Facebook. Let me know what you got there. Do you have um, the uh, number 47, which was, uh, what, the world of Germany, the best of Germany, or the uh, number 48? Uh, I can't remember what that was called. What was that called? Got to look back at my notes. <laughs> oh, yeah, the five-pack with the mud. Yeah, that one was cool too. The 10 pack, excuse me, adventure one. Yeah. All right. Come on over to Facebook, Roverland. Show me and tell me what you got. 
Join me on Instagram, Roverland Channel. And as always, you know it. Slow traffic, keep right. And have a great rover day.